it's now time for Calling All Horror Hounds. <laughs> okay, Horror Hounds, now believe it or not, we have been doing this show for 65 episodes. Horror Hounds has been a staple of the show for quite some time now, and yet somehow we have not yet discussed one of the greats of the, of the horror genre. Yes, friends, it is time to talk Reanimator, the movie that gave us the tremendous Herbert West as played by Jeffrey Combs, one of the great genre actors, a nutty mad scientist type who uses his neon green serum to bring the dead back to life in a movie that is vaguely based on the work of H.P. Lovecraft. Reanimator is a superlative gore fest, a superlative tongue-in-cheek gore fest. This is a movie that blood and viscera flies throughout this thing, and yet it is a movie with an enormous sense of humor that is not campy, is not winking to the camera, but knows what it is and is unafraid to have an hilarious sequence fighting a dead cat in the middle of it. If you've seen the movie, you know what I mean, and I think that you do. Directed by Stuart Gordon, uh, a towering figure in 80s horror. I believe his very first uh, big feature film. Also starring Scream Queen, Scream Queen Barbara Crampton in, I think, her first role and doing a terrific job here. But of course, this whole movie belongs to Jeffrey Combs, and man, does he do a heck of a lot with it here. There's not really a ton to say about it. This is also the movie wherein a professor gets his head cut off and then West reanimates the head and the body separately and you have the, oh, I can show you what it looks like, kind of. I can show you what it looks like, kind of. Hold on, where you have the body walking around with just the head. That's a pretty good thing. Oh, I'm back to life. But otherwise, stop wondering, folks, why I have a head just off camera where I can get at it and get Reanimator going, watch it again, watch it for the first time. Four stars. And don't forget to visit our website, northmetrotv.com slash everymovieever. There, you can watch reviews of every movie we've ever covered here on the show, as well as complete episodes. That's northmetrotv.com slash everymovieever.